the question is, do you think artists of whatever kind can actually make any difference? And this is a, this is a hugely important question. I, I do believe that artists can make a difference. Um, and we see this through history as, as artists have helped change consciousness through, I mean, Charles Dickens was crucial in raising awareness of um, the treatment of the poor. And artists of all time have, humans are storytelling creatures and the stories we tell affect how we act. And we know this, I mean, this, this, the Bible has many, many stories about how humans are above non-humans and how men are above women. And you don't think that that has affected behavior? And there are many stories of, I was just last night thinking again about Richard Slotkin, who wrote an extraordinary series. And one of the, one of the books is called Gunfighter Nation. And it's his, his, one of his central theses is that he's looking at popular fiction from, let's say, the, I don't know, 1780s through, through 1970 or something. And how in popular fiction, there was a pattern of, gosh, um, you know, we white people want to fight clean, but the Indians fight dirty, which means we have to fight dirty just this once. And then when it moved up to the, to the, um, to the war against Mexico in the 1830s, it's like, well, we want to fight clean, but those Mexicans, they fight dirty. So we have to fight dirty just this once. Go to the 1870s, we white people want to fight clean, but those Indians, they fight dirty. So just this once, we got to fight dirty. Let's move it up to the 1960s. We white people want to fight clean, but the Vietnamese, they fight dirty. So just this once, we got to fight dirty. It's the Dirty Harry plot for a cop, you know, with a cop show that, well, we want to be clean, but the, cop, but the, but the criminals fight dirty, so we got to fight dirty. And that has effects on how we behave. And I mean, what effect do you think it has on us that I've had to fight my publishers in order for me to be able to say the tree who does this as opposed to the tree that? And so yes, artists can make a difference. But also one of the most important lines that I've ever written has been every morning when I wake up, I ask myself whether I should write or blow up a dam. And the reason that's an important line is because art by itself doesn't accomplish anything in the real world. It takes two. It takes the artist and then, and it can be the same person actually. After I say that every morning when I wake up, I ask myself whether I should write or blow up a dam, I go on to talk about how it's not words or a lack of words, it's killing salmon, it's dams. At some point, the dams need to physically come down. So art, art can be a catalyst and it should be a catalyst, but a catalyst needs the primary chemicals to have the chemical reaction take place. So art can be a catalyst for change, but it's not the change itself. That change needs to come in the real physical world.